Hey lads, what are we dragging today? It's this character. He's a dragon born. There we go. Doing uh, Fitzpatrick's Defense's quest because it's quite a good quest to do early on when you first get to the harbor. You talk to Fitzpatrick's Defense and he gives you a gem bag to have, and this increases your little bit of a quality of life because now you can open the gem bag in your inventory. Uh, check mark that auto gather button and hit gather and then all of your gems that you will pick up throughout the mission in chests and in crates and barrels and things that you break will go into there instead and then you can still sell them all with one click of a button at any salesman by hitting the sell gems button once you go to sell. So anyway, in exchange for him giving us the bag, he asks us to go collect some gems that he lost. So these those gems are going to be in this one, in the smuggler's warehouse. It's been infested by kobolds and they have hidden the gems away in all the barrels. So... You need to go into this place and destroy all the barrels you see. So, the gems will only be in barrels, they won't be in crates or any other destructible. So you just have to go through the whole mission level, find as many barrels as you can, and uh, smash them. And uh, yeah, that's what I'm going to show you where they are now. So here, crate, they won't be in crates, but, you know, ransack bonus, we can, we can get a little ransack bonus by destroying some crates. So he's gonna go ring a gong because kobolds love ringing gongs. It's like their favorite thing in the world to do. I'm pretty sure there's two shamans up here. There's one behind me as well on the opposite level, like elevated area. And they know lightning bolt. I'm gonna pull a lever since I'm up here. Where is there they are? Take out all these guys. Get the key from this chest. It's gonna be relevant in like about five seconds. It's to open that gate. So yeah, no barrels yet as of then. Scorpion. There we go. Okay, so here door opened. I'm gonna jump because there is a frost trap right there. So you wanna be careful with that. There was a barrel on the top of this stuff. And there we go, we broke that barrel, and there is one Smuggler's Ruby. Break this barrel, not be so lucky that time. It won't be every barrel, but it will only be in barrels. And make sure you, uh, you know, kill the things that are trying to kill you before uh, running around and looking for the barrels. It's a pretty important thing to do. Barrel? No Ruby. Ah, oh, I didn't jump quite. Perfectly there. Take out all the enemies, and now we can survey this room properly for barrels. So there's one right there. Nothing. Another barrel here. No ruby. Barrel. No ruby. Barrel. No ruby. Barrel. Smuggler's ruby. There we go. Two out of eight. There's one barrel up there that I do want to get. I'm pretty sure the ice jets have used up. And if not, you can just do that. They have not used up. But no ruby there that time. Okay, once you're done with this room of destroying all the barrels in this one, you can head off in this northern direction. And we'll work our way through the dungeon in a manner. Okay, barrel here, but no ruby. Barrel, no ruby. It can be any barrel. It's not the set barrels every time as well. We're going to head down this path because it's a bit of a dead end. So we'll just clear it out and clear all the barrels that are along this way. And see if we get lucky. If you can have good spot and search skills, you can open this door, which we will attempt to. But we did get a Smuggler's Ruby in that barrel right there, so that is pretty good. Barrel? Nope, no Smuggler's Ruby there. Alright, I am going to use a Focus Enchant to boost my skills, and then we're going to do a little search right here. And we do get it. Fantastic. So this will reveal a bunch of scorpions. A little chest. So that's pretty okay. Nothing wrong with a little chest every now and then. Uh, I don't remember if this one's trapped or not. It doesn't seem to be. We get a bunch of garbage, but nothing too bad. Through here, there should be at least one more barrel in here. A little rare spawn, which Dr. Chiku. Mm, no barrels. However, we did get the rare spawn and got a nice little chest out of it, so that's quite nice. 
little bit of uh, technical goggles there. It's pretty good, pretty handy. So no more barrels here. We will head down the other way, down this spider-infested corridor. Make sure you don't miss that barrel that was behind there, because you won't see it coming this way. You'd have to turn around and check. And there was a smuggler's ruby in there for us. So we're nearly halfway through. I'm going to uh, recast the old blur spell on us. And recast Expedition's Retreat as well. And here, you want to jump. And as long as you jump twice, you're fine. You won't get hit by the trap that's there. Okay, you just want to get rid of these scorpions. I'm sure they want to do the same to you, so you just gotta be the aggressor. Fair amount of barrels here with a Smuggler's Ruby in that one, so that's paying off. Another Smuggler's Ruby. Very lucky, very lucky. Another barrel over here. Nothing there that time, though. Great. And a barrel right there. Nope, no Smuggler's Ruby that time. Barrel, and a sneaky barrel hiding in the corner there. We're giving this room a good once over. That is all the barrels here, and then we can move on in this direction. Couple spiders. Mm, yeah, nothing. Little barrel right there. Don't miss those, those side barrels. Nothing in that little side barrel. Crate, crate, crate. No barrel. Barrel. A few barrels here. One, two barrels. Other gemstones, but no smuggler's ruby. Okay. Nope, nothing there. Quite a few barrels in this room. Barrel, destroyed, barrel, barrel, destroyed, destroyed. No Smuggler's Ruby. No Smuggler's Ruby. No Smuggler's Ruby. Okay, so, and I believe that's all the barrels in this section. Okay, this is a fire trap. You want to be careful and um, not die. So the way you do that is you uh, jump. There you go. It has a bit of a delay, so a bit of speed gets you a long way there. Uh, from here, that leads back to the main room that you first came in in. So if we just head this way, we will discover new areas where we have not smashed barrels yet. Checking the corners behind. Again, focusing on the shamans first. There we go. Put a few throwers left, and they're not too bad at all. There we go. So after the kobolds are all dealt with, we can smash a few more barrels that are just around. And hopefully, there we go, get a smuggler's ruby there. Get another smuggler's ruby there. And is that most of them? I think that's most of them. We can uh, open the store for a little rest shrine if you need it. If you feel like you've been uh, in need of a rest, if you've gotten beat up a little bit. But that's okay, we're going to keep on trekking just fine. Pulling this lever will reveal more of the area. Bit of a barrel right there. The Smuggler's Ruby for us. And I do believe that most of the things done. Take this guy out. Okay, so he has opened this funny extra door, and there is a little mini boss right there. That is fine. A little bit of a shield, nothing too bad. We did get a nice deed out of it, so that's pretty nice. Uh, pulling this lever will open that right there, which should reveal a couple barrels. This is the barricaded area that we saw from the other side before. And that is the last Smuggler's Ruby right there in that barrel. And not too soon, because we basically explored the entire area, so we were really running low on barrels. The only other barrels we'd have would be about that one, I think, and I think that's essentially it. Oh, and this guy right here. Ooh, the 11th Smuggler's Ruby. Uh, but aside from that, yeah, I don't think we missed too many other barrels. So yeah, we can finish and leave the dungeon now. That was, that was a pretty, pretty efficient... <sighs> Look around and showcase of every barrel in this dungeon. So that's that's pretty that's pretty good. If you're a bit unluckier, then 
that's all that's all the barrels. I don't know what to tell you. Alright, uh give us the cut of the thing. Something about smashing barrels. And with that, that's all I got for you today. Thank you for joining in on the old barrel smashing, and it's been uh, it's been great. Join us for the next one. Bye bye.